New drone training for some first responders in Southside is already proving valuable. The Danville Life Saving Crew in Pennsylvania County Sheriff's Office just had their first chance to use the training in a real rescue. WSLS 10's Coulter Anstat tells us how the training worked. We went ahead and deployed this drone. As members of the Danville Life Saving Crew and Pennsylvania County Sheriff's Office headed to the Dan River yesterday to rescue a logger pinned down after a tree fell on one of his hands, they were already preparing to use their drones. Danville Life Saving Crew Assistant Director Brian Fox says that helped reduce the stress of the situation. We were developing a plan, talking on the radio on the way out. We knew what we were going to do, how many drones we were going to use. <laughs> Fox says the training he and others went through last month to become certified drone operators perfectly prepared them for the rescue. Once everyone was on scene, the drones were deployed in a matter of minutes and they immediately began making the rescue safer. We were able to navigate the boats around some circumstances in the water, some debris, some rock formations that they didn't see from the boat as they were trying to navigate. Jim Mullins is a Swiftwater rescue member for the Danville Life Saving Crew and was in one of the boats. Brian put his drone in the air. He went down initially to make sure there were no hazards that we had to know about. Mullins says the drones also came in handy at the end of the rescue as the pin down man was brought back across the river to be taken to a hospital. The drone could be put up to watch to make sure there was no incident uh, and bringing them up. I did reach out to the Pennsylvania County Sheriff's Office today for an interview, but did not get a response. In Danville, Coulter Anstat, WSLS 10.